Hi, welcome back to our channel. In this video, we'll explore the incredible features of Midjourney version 5 and show you how to harness its power. If you've written a comment on my last post about the Midjourney version 5 giveaway prompt, you're eligible for one free Midjourney 5 prompt. Just type your prompt in this video's comment section, but before doing that, make sure you watch this entire video to ensure your prompt is suitable for this new model. I can only give away 100 free prompts. Please note that the image result I provide will be the first generated image, not the upscaled version. So, make sure you have the best version of your prompt. Remember to keep your prompts appropriate. Avoid any racist, sexual, or offensive content. The first to submit will be the first to receive the service. At the end of this video, I'll show you how to access your Midjourney 5 image. So, let's dive right in. Currently, only premium subscriptions can use Midjourney version 5 features. To start using the Midjourney v5 model, simply add the v5 parameter to the end of your prompt. Essential parameters 1. Aspect ratio The aspect ratio parameter adjusts the generated image width to height ratio. It is typically represented as two numbers separated by a colon. Changing this parameter alters the image aspect ratio. 2. Stylize. The Midjourney bot is trained to create images with an artistic flair, emphasizing color, composition, and form. The stylize parameter determines the intensity of this artistic approach. Lower stylization values result in images that closely resemble the prompt but are less artistic. Higher stylization values produce highly artistic images that may be less related to the prompt. 3. Tile. By adjusting the tile parameter, you can generate images that serve as repeating tiles. These can be used to create seamless patterns for fabrics, wallpapers, and textures. 4. Multi prompts. To indicate that the Midjourney bot should consider each part of the prompt separately, add a double colon between the parts. For example, the prompt hot dog generates images of tasty hot dogs. When using a double colon to separate a prompt into different parts, you can add a number immediately after the double colon to assign relative importance to that part of the prompt. Midjourney version 5 in action! Now let's run some prompts to show you how good Midjourney is. We will create a logo, vertical image, horizontal image, realistic photography, landscape, and tiles. Let's get started!
To download your Midjourney 5 image, follow these simple steps. 1. Go to adelsarena.com and click the prompt menu. 2. Search for the code that I provided in my reply to your comment. 3. After you found the post, open it and click the download button to download your image. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel for more exciting updates on AI technology. See you in the next video!